Hi guys, my name is Naomi Johnson. I'm in region 16 and 17. And uh, my success story is that I was working with a lady. It was actually transferred um, to me, the case was, and I do supervised visits and casework with her. And the casework referral had expired. And um, this mom has a couple young children and wasn't showing up uh, for the casework. And I was doing visits with her, but it was really, really rough situations. Um, just a lot of like home cleanliness issues. She was having a lot of uh, mental instability, a lot of um, just, she would get real frustrated about different things. And so I um, had met with her one day because she, to do a suicidal prevention plan with her because she was making suicidal comments in the visits. And so when I met with her, she was just like, I'm done. I'm moving out of the town, out of the city, and I'm just gonna leave my kids, I'm giving up. And so she was really just at the end of her rope. And she had been doing this for, she's been in the case for a long time. And um, I got to lay hands on her and pray for her and just speak hope into her. And it was amazing because it didn't change right there in that moment. I left the house that night, um, just been praying for her. And then I had a visit with her here recently, and she was just talking about how much she loves her kids. She was telling them, I'm not going to let you go for anything. And she has this renewed hope. And so she's going to be meeting with me for casework sessions, and we're going to uh, just start to get the ball rolling. And so I'm really excited because I just see the power of prayer and how it changes things. And just that little bit of hope. If, you know, with your clients, if you have a hopeless situation, I just encourage you, just like, you know, I'm just like you and just speaking that hope into them that, you know, they don't have to give up and it can change everything.